Hey everyone, I just read Halo Renegades by Kelly Gay, and I really couldn't stand this one. Halo after Halo 3 was a mistake. It's a book about the crew of the salvage ship, the Ace of Spades, off in search of the captain's long disappeared father, who happened to cross paths with a certain crashed Oni ship called the Rubicon, which makes it not only a direct sequel to Smoke and Shadow, but Primordium too. Oh no. The pros? I will give the book this. The way it continued both plots by incorporating the manner in which both previous books were told, third person for Smoke and Shadow, and first person for Primordium, was well done and did give the novel a sense of continuity with those prior entries that utilising one or the other probably wouldn't have. The book's focus on self actualization after great change or significant loss was really interesting, even if I did not like the characters involved in those plot threads at all. And it was nice to finally get some closure on plot threads that have been left hanging for many books at this point, if only for the sake of that closure. The cons? You know who really did not need a redemption arc in this series? 3 4 3 Guilty Spark. Just let him be evil, and more importantly, just let him be dead. I could not stand the crew members of the Ace of Spades, aside from the Captain, whose name I've already forgotten again. They weren't too bad in Smoke and Shadow, but it felt like every single scene they shared here they were just bickering, and I understand why given their character arcs, but this kind of forced interpersonal conflict that drags on forever is such a lazy and frustrating writing device. I couldn't stand it. And like with so many of these Halo tie-in books, there's just nothing to get invested in. There's not enough interesting stuff from the games at this point, and what little there is, I absolutely absolutely hated. I just didn't care about anything that happened in this story, beyond its technical construction and its themes. I hated this one. Don't read it. It's not worth it. And I'm giving Halo Renegades an F. Sorry. What should I read next? Comment a suggestion down below. If you liked the review and want to see more, please like, subscribe, and share the video around. I'd really appreciate it. Thanks for watching.